hasn't returned. I need someone I can count on to go in after him and bring him back alive. I've heard great things about you, which is why I'm asking for your help. I'll be waiting for you in the ruins. Please hurry. <laughs> Alright. Well, the stream apparently just cut out for like a second, which is annoying. So I'm going to reload because I'm pretty sure people missed things. Which is really dumb. Which is really, really dumb. Stupid fucking shit. Also, did my game crash when I reloaded the quick save? Because I swear to god. Might have. It very well might have. Oh boy! <clears throat> what a good day. What a good day. Oh man, I don't know what to do. I don't know how to fix these problems. I might need to, uh... I might need to start a new save, just because I've tinkered with so much of this save that it's gotten corrupted slightly, and it just crashes now because of that. Um... But, uh, I don't want to do that because then all of our progress is gone. Um, which sucks. Uh, let's... Yeah, the bandits, whatever. They're not gonna bother us. Nice, the farmer, going to the Stormcloaks. Great. Falkreath is just below us. <laughs> Which is where we're heading. Hey, you can see the carrier. Look at him, he's running around trying to find us. save actually I wanted to wait 12 hours and see what would happen so he's just gonna like stand is it, when I get back in is he just gonna be like standing right there I've been yes. looking for you got something I'm supposed to deliver <laughs> your hands only let's see here I have a letter here for you looks like that's it got to go Riches beyond imagining. I found these words inscribed in ancient dwarven ruins in the Reach. I believe they mark the entrance to a forgotten city. My brother went in a few days ago and hasn't returned. I need someone I can count on to go in after him and bring him back alive. I've heard great things about you, which is why I'm asking for your help. I'll be waiting for you in the ruins. Please hurry. And remember, riches beyond imagining. Cassia. Okay. The Forgotten City. Cassia. Alright. 
Who's still in the stream? Don't Curious. Let my brother get to you, Tinkler. You're doing a fine job around here. Thank you, sir. Try not to judge Falkreath too harshly, visitor. The war has been hard on us. Unless you intend to bury someone, this isn't the place you're looking for, traveler. Actually, I'm supposed to be going into this inn and talking to somebody. Alright. So, let's see how that goes. Yes, yes, I haven't got all day. Wow, this is Fancy very crowded. You a wizard or something? All right, let's talk to everyone. Well met. Whoa. Unlike my brother, I have no dislike of strangers. Met lots of them while I was a stormcloak. You mentioned a brother? His name's Bolin. He's the one who works the lumber mill down by the river. If you meet him, don't expect much in the way of conversation. He ain't one for talking, especially with folk he don't know. Okay. I was once, but not anymore. I was wounded in a skirmish up near Windhelm. This was years ago, mind you. Now, maybe I don't pick up a blade in Ulfric's name no more, but I still hold with his ideals. Skyrim is Nordland, and we ought to rule it. We don't need no help from the Empire on that count. Okay. Steal anything from my Jesus shop Christ. and you'll regret it. Need something? I just don't want to have like a thousand people. Speak quickly. All right. If she could just spend less time serving Dengir. What's a milk ah, drinker like you doing out now. here? What Go even are you? Your mother. You shouldn't talk to me like that. Why? What are you gonna do? Cry? Back off. I don't have to take that from you. Victory is yours. I submit. You're not worth it. Huh. Am I supposed Fight to kill him? Well. Fight well. Let's try this one more time. Why? What are you gonna do? I don't have to take that from you. Well, the dead man's drink. At some point we should What's a milk drinker here. like? If Why? What are you gonna do? I don't have to take that from you. Ah, I wish I could afford to pay you both, Nari. I really do. I escaped fighting in Cyrodiil, only to have it track me down again in Skyrim. You hear any juicy gossip so in town? People. Sure You're going to, to have the men around here wrapped around your finger in no time. <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. All right, come in here, Sophie. Next time. You need to hear this. Sophie, you're bad. Use the door, Sophie. Come on. You can do it. Good, Sophie. Good. All right. Sir. The civil war. It's, this is a local it's bad for Skyrim. One of the first songs Let's hope it ends quickly. Ragnar the Rip. Just reading your book, sir. Don't mind me. All right. Oh, <coughs> I always heard the legends in my childhood, but I always thought they were fairy tales. But they're true. Why? Why must there be singing in the background? <coughs> Are you Marcus Janus? Janus? Jonas? You wanted to see me about Helgen. Oh, bless the divines! You came. Well met, and welcome. We have much to discuss. Will you tell me? What happened at Helgen? Uh. If you already know Helgen was attacked by a dragon, have you ever seen one? You mean the part before I almost got my head cut off, or after? We'll start with after. Your past is none of my concern. That you survived, however, is. Did you see if anyone else made it out of there? Where are the families, the children? How is my daughter? I have no idea. I doubt any civilians made it out of there alive. The place was laid to waste. Then it's as I feared. My brother and his family are lost. At some God point damn it all. I'd hoped for better news. Even if they did survive the dragon attack, the bandits killed them for sure. Yes, wow. I the fort is full of them. But appearances can also be deceiving. 
If I'm right, these are no bandits at all. I have it on good authority there is a man known only as Val inside the keep. He's the leader of a small group of mercenaries, for lack of a better term. Their aim is to kill Thalmor wherever they're found. That they've come out of hiding is beyond mysterious. They're insurrectionists. A resistance movement, if you will. What? Insurrectionists? And you know this man? His name is Valerius Tiberius Artoria. We served for many years together in the Imperial Legion, as captains under Titus Mede II during the Great War. He was a good man in those days, an honorable man. Then the Aldmeri invaded and murdered his wife, son, and daughter in cold blood. They murdered his family? Tell me more, please. So what does they, does, exactly does this have to do with me, with me? I need you to go try and talk to Valerius. Reason with him. Tell him Marcus Janus requests a meeting with him. Tell him I'll come to the fort alone. Present company excluded, of course. At some point Give this ring to him. Yeah, it was his wife's wedding ring. Why do you have that? If any of his men try to accost you, show it to them and tell them it is a gesture of goodwill from me. They'll give you quarter if they know I sent you. Approach the guards and show them the ring. Tell them Marcus Janus sent you to see Valerius Tiberius Artoria on urgent business. Show them this note with my seal, but tell them it's for Valerius, his eyes only. Please return to me as soon as you can. I'll prepare to leave and be ready to go when you return. Make haste, young one, and may fortune favor the foolish. Okay. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh. Okay. What the? <laughs> I open the door and there's like arms and shit that come out. All right. I guess it's time to head over to Hel Helget. I guess. <laughs> So that's a thing. Haven't, uh... Alright, I mean... Oh, they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Yes, they're reforming the Dawn Guard! There's a thing by Riften, thank you. <laughs> Alright. To Helgen! Oh, JB, you sly dog. Having sex with my seven year old daughter. I do love causing a stir. Once I started singing at the top of my voice, and someone told me to stop shouting. Then I replied, Do I look dragonborn or like one of those creepy old guys who live on the mountain tops to you? <laughs> what? Oh, these are blinks. Shit. Okay. <laughs> Taking a break. Done with it. Done. Nope. Can't take it. It's literally 